Oh my God, this is absolutely insane. It is Saturday morning here at the Burbank Card Show. Dude. There's Rob, this line is going on crazy. This is gonna be one of the most insane card show days you have ever seen. Let's do this. Hey guys, look at this. I told you this was gonna be a busy card show today. This is turning out to be pretty epic. The dealers are doing deals all over the show floor. Lots of energy, lots of activity, lots of money being spent, which is a great thing here for the hobby. I'm excited about this. All right, guys, I'm gonna blow your mind with this one. Bunny just walked up to me here at this show. You wanna talk about fire? Guys, oh my goodness. This is LeBron's rookie year. This is 2003. That is his jersey from his rookie year. That is Jordan's jersey. That is on card auto of LeBron and Jordan. And that is a gold numbered to 10. It's pretty darn iconic. Bunny, thanks for sharing it. Hey man, thank you. For sure. Hey guys, I found Jason and Brett. You guys have seen them on our channel before and you've seen them on the Netflix show, Selling Sunset. Guys, welcome to the card show. Good, good to see you, man. Yeah, I appreciate Always you guys making the drive out here. It's great yeah. to see you guys again. What's your opinion been? There's some epic cards here yeah. for sure. I mean, I try not to get too much modern, but it's tempting sometimes. because there's be They're just so beautiful. There's an epic LeBron over there. I think yeah. you saw that one. There's, there's just some amazing cards here. So it's, yeah. it's, it's new to me. Yeah. You know, I've seen videos of it, a lot of your content. Right. But we've never seen it in person, so. Yeah. You also didn't see cards worth more than like $100 yeah. on the card shows around here. You got, you know, there's three cards all a million bucks over there. Yeah. You got grading companies. We weren't, when we went, you know, there was no grading. Like, yeah. I think we haven't gone since like the 90s. I don't yeah, remember. It's a whole new world. We Great to see you guys. See you around, man. Yeah, Good for sure. Anybody. For sure. Yeah, absolutely. Take care, man. Yeah. All right, so Jet just walked up to me with a really nice Jalen Hurts card. Look at that. That's number to 35. On card auto, rated rookie. That's a beautiful Jalen Hurts card. A really clean autograph, too. Now, general rule of advice. So we're filming this the day before the Super Bowl. Generally, not the time period to get one of the quarterbacks because things tend to calm down a little bit. Prices tend to go down in the off season. But I actually don't own any Jalen Hurts cards and that's a pretty sweet one. So we'll take a look. Maybe we can work out a little trade here. So here's my trade proposal for you. I would offer you that Zion, which is numbered to 299, plus the Jason Tatum for the Jalen Hurts. I feel value wise, Probably pretty good. Maybe you're coming out slightly ahead, but I think it's right around the same, Could right I around count? the same ballpark. You want to counter? Um, sure. That Zion and that Edwards, and I add cash. That Zion and that Edwards, and you add cash. Okay. All right. Well, let's make sure we're, we know the prices on those two. So this one we had at a thousand dollars, right? Let's double check this one. I think this one's four hundred or so. It would be pretty cool that you'd have both penmanship. Hurts and one hundred for those two. Okay, that's good. You see, you got to come out with a strong offer right you got to come out so that's i like that right especially since you're putting a little cash in the deal you want to try to get the better end of the yeah. deal so that's good that you're doing that so i would counter and say the hertz plus 150 dollars cash for those two cards and i think you're i think you're coming out ahead you want to do it, let's do it. awesome let's do it there we go yeah that's actually a pretty big deal we just got done there on the show floor that's exciting i've now turned myself into a massive eagles fan you know hope <laughs> My team back there is booing me. Teapot, Teapot's a big Chiefs guy. So go, but go Eagles. I'm now Team Eagles. Let's go. That's fun, man. I love doing deals on the show floor with kids. It's a lot of fun. And uh, you never know what people got in their cases, man. Kids are savvy. Awesome. There we go. Dylan just walked up to me with this card. And I've got some interest in this one because my son Reeves at the Atlanta card show got the 2020 Joe Burrow green scope autograph card same exact card except joe burrow this is trevor lawrence the following year green scope autograph card and so i uh, i think reeves would think it was pretty special if i had the trevor lawrence and he had the joe burrow we kind of put them together let me pull some cards out you can start taking a look through so here's the pile that i kind of picked out of stuff i liked okay. here's where we're at right now so he's got this trevor lawrence green scope that we put a price on of 1100. I got this, I just picked up this Jalen Hurts earlier today in a trade. I hate to get rid of it, it's a beautiful card, uh, but I will if the opportunity's right and I really like the Trevor Lawrence. So this one's right around 1200, so that's about a $100 difference. And then he also really likes this Kyler Murray. This is a one of one Kyler Murray that I picked up a while ago. My last remaining Kyler Murray, I believe from that big collection of cards that I picked up. And so this one's probably 250 to 300 in that range. So. 
He would like both of those. So we get a value of upwards of about 1500. That's 1100. So we're gonna see if we can maybe close that gap with another one of his cards. What would you want cash for that to that? I think a hundred bucks. hundred bucks? I'd be comfortable with a hundred bucks. Did you do 80? Yeah, I'd do 80 bucks for you. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, there you go. There you go. All right, cool. We got a deal done. We got a deal done. I got some upside with Trevor Lawrence next season. He's got some immediate upside right now. The Super Bowl is tomorrow as of when we're filming this. So hopefully, hopefully the Eagles deliver a victory for you and, and your card is uh, your card goes forward. Look at that. Awesome. Good doing a deal with you. Yeah, absolutely. This show is a ton of fun. But even if you can't be here, you can have fun 24-7 by going on Whatnot. Scan that QR code on your screen or use the link in the show notes in the show description and I'll put $10 in free credit in your Whatnot account the first time that you register. There's breaks and single sales going on all day and night on Whatnot starting at just a dollar. Check it out right now. Wow, look at this card. Lou Gehrig, Albert Pujols, and Jamie Foxx. That's pretty sweet. Looks like a little bit of jersey and a little bit of bat. Yeah, game worn and game used. So that's a game worn Lou Gehrig and game used bats for Jamie Jamie Foxx and Albert Pujols. What are you? What do you think the value of that I'd is? Do like 175. That's not bad. I mean, that's not a bad price. I figured out that's a one of one Joel Embiid. So this one, I think I picked up at the Atlanta show. I think I, I think around two hundred and fifty dollars. Um, I'd be cool with doing a straight up trade on that one if you want. You want to do straight up? Cool. I think that's a good trade for you. I think you did well with that trade. You want a trade up challenge? Yeah. Okay. So what? So what do you have here? You guys Tom both have Brady, Tom Brady silver select. cards. Silver, yeah. So what did you start with? A dollar. A dollar. And yeah. so is this the and you traded up to get these? Uh, yeah. This is like our third trade, I think. Your third trade. Yeah. So I like when I like when kids do trade up challenges at card shows. I know it actually annoys the dealers sometimes because they got a lot of kids coming up to them wanting to trade up and trade up. But I love it because it teaches kids the hustle and the grind to getting out there and working to get their money, right? Using the show floor to be able to flip and flip and flip and turn something small into something big. That's one of the really cool things you can do in the sports card world. We're trying to beat our friends. You're trying to beat your friends? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna help you beat your friends, okay? Because I love that you're doing this. Okay, so you've got, you got a Tom Brady card there that I think is worth a few bucks. All right, I'm gonna help you out here. Let me see what this, let me look at market movers to see what this Lamar Jackson's been going for. Whoop, I took a bad photo. Oh, it worked anyway. All right, so this, this Lamar Jackson, in, according to market movers, has been selling between about $64 and about $71. Is that a nice trade? Yes. I think that's, that's a pretty crazy. good trade deal. There you go. Thank you I think so I think you're gonna get a jump on your friends. All right. All right, Chloe, let's get you hooked up as well here. So you got a Tom Brady card as well. Let me see what I got to help you out with. So this is Jalen Brunson. He was a really good player for the Mavericks. Now he's on the Knicks. He's playing really well. This is his rookie card with an on-card auto. This sold on eBay just the other day for $107. So would you think that's a fair trade? That's to trade amazing. your couple dollar Tom yeah. Brady for $107 yeah. Jalen Brunson? That's yours. Thank you so much. All right, you're welcome. I want to support you guys in your trade-up challenge. You. I hope you beat your friends, and I hope you turn those into something even bigger. Thank you. Enjoy Thank yourself. You. All right, so what was the big card that you picked up at the Atlanta card show? Green Scope. Joe Burrow? Yeah. Green Scope? Yep. On card autograph? Number to 75? So you got the you got the Joe Burrow, Green Scope, number to 75, autograph card from Prism. Yeah, so what do you think of that? I thought you might like that to go with your burrow. I thought you might want to trade me for it. I mean, yes. I have a trade proposal for you. I want that card. You got that card last night at trade night. I've been jealous of that card. That's number to five from 2021, but it's Spectra. I like that card. Hey, that's an achievement. He's jealous of one of my cards. That card will pair perfectly with your burrow. Perfectly. If my borough grades a nine. If your borough grades a nine, it would pair perfectly together. What do you I think? I don't know how much to say for. Um, we put a trade value of 1100 on it. So you picked up that for 800 trade value last night. Yeah, but this one, this, we oh, we think it's worth more. We think it's worth more. This one I just picked up for 1100 trade value. Price a little bit uncertain on that because none of those, those have sold recently at all. But I think it's, I think it's a, 
I'm offering you a straight up trade. I think you should take it. You wanna do it? You wanna do the deal? Yep. Okay, there you go. Let's go. So there we go, I got a trade deal done with my own son, Reeves. I knew he would love that card because he got the Joe Burrow at the last card show. Now he's got the exact Trevor Lawrence to match it. And I like this card. He picked this up last night at the trade night here at the Burbank card show. And it's one that I had my eye on. This one's number to five. So I knew we'd be able to work a deal and we did. That's awesome, man. Wow, what a day that was here at the Burbank card show. So many trade deals, so many deals with kids. There were so many kids on the show floor today. I love to see it. Hey guys, if you appreciated the episode today, do me a favor and download the Market Movers app on your phone. It's free to try out. Just go to the App Store and search for Market Movers. And we'd also appreciate a like, a subscribe, and we'll see you soon with our next episode. Take care.